See that? Uh, you thought I was going to do the loud noise, didn't you? So what is going on, guys? This is Ryan here, and welcome back to another episode of Undertale. Come on, come in, come in. Let's get this adventure started. Come, come, sit. Welcome, guys, to part six of Undertale. We are really starting to grind through this series some more. Now, in the last episode, quite a lot went on, especially with Undyne. At first, she was trying to be very, very intimidating towards us, but I guess she started to see the true nature of us as a human. It turns out that the land currently has six out of the seven human souls that they need, and I guess because we were showing a lot of mercy towards a lot of the characters, Undyne saw the same thing in us, and she don't want to take our soul. And now I'm gonna talk to a duck. The last thing we did was actually went to Undyne's house and then we proceeded to burn it down pretty ferociously indeed. So yeah, let's not talk about that again. However, we found out that Undyne now is residing at Papyrus's place. So you already know I've got to go back, guys. And I think this little bird here is gonna help us. So the little bird wants to carry you across. Get a ride, let's see. Yo, literally like a backpack. Okay, those back feet locking in place. This is... There are some things in life which need no context, okay? Nor do we need an explanation. This is gorgeous, guys. I can't believe we're seeing this happen right now. I'm slightly emotionally distraught. I really am. I smash like for the duck right now. What the freak? Come on right now. Wait, what is this? Hold up a second. This little squishy dude. Three gold for the ferry. Uh, wait, where does it take us to? I kind of guess I should, you know? Hop on! All right. It's gonna take us to... We got the underground ferry. I mean, it worked. Thanks for stepping on my face. Here's the three gold. You got three gold? Completely free ride? Uh. So I think right here, we're near enough back towards, what was it called? Snowden Village. Yeah, that's it. And we gotta go back to Papyrus's place because I wanna see what Undyne and Papyrus are doing. We learned that Undyne was actually training Papyrus up quite a bit. So let's see how that's going. Let's uh, let's eavesdrop. Hey, Papyrus. I know Undyne's there. How are you guys getting on? Hello. Well, here they are, right here. Let's talk to him. I'm so glad you and Undyne are friends now. You two go together like pasta and Bernie. <laughs> Um, is, is that good? Hey, punk, what's up? Achoo! Papyrus, how can you stand this cold? I have no skin, so why don't we stand in grillbies instead? Because I hate grease! But you don't have a stomach. Um, this is getting very complicated. No, but I have standards! Okay, is that it? Can we do anything else? Papyrus, why do you live in an icy wasteland? The rent's cheap. Really? Don't you something? Yeah, but my brother pays for it. Where's your brother get the money to pay for it? Oh, that's simple. It's a mystery. Uh, yes, yes. Wait, hold up a second. So we've seen that I think Sans was in several other locations. Can we now enter Sans's room? Let me see. Hold up. The door is locked. Dang. There's got to be a way that we can get inside there, though, dude. I want to see. Wait, what? It's a... Oh, I thought I said soggy. I was about to say... Now, that's a lot more disgusting than before. How about if we talk to him again? Let's see. Okay, he's mumbling the same crap as before. Dude, lack of record on repeat. Same with this one as well. Guys, you're just repeating yourself. Wait, who is this friend here? Everything's so dirty. If I could erase everything, I would. Oh, don't get the wrong idea. I don't want anyone to die. People turn to dust when they die, and that's hard to clean up. All right, three more gold for the ferry. Hop on. We're going underwater. Let's do this. Hold up a sec, guys. I'm actually going to try the race again. So, Tenji, now, if I let them just do their thing, maybe we'll win. I'm not even going to encourage it once. I'm going to allow it to race how it wants to race. It's not my business. Look, you can already see the guys kind of slow. Uh, you going to speed up there, buddy? Is your last place? Yeah, so I didn't encourage it, and again, I lost. I'm very confused about this race. Maybe the point is to not win this? Maybe it's just to show that, you know, these things can do whatever they want. Oh, you both tried your best, but the snail looks discouraged. Her best wasn't good enough. Oh, um... Wait, I don't really understand. How can I make the snail feel good? I'm gonna try one more time, guys. You'll see the end result. So yeah, you see my face full screen right now, guys. I didn't win again. Now, you know, one thing I noticed about this adventure so far, my gold is about 620, and there was something at the Temi shop. I think it was like advanced armor or something for 1,000 G. I'm kind of tempted to try and battle as many monsters as I can and uh, make some gold from it and see if maybe I get the item and it encourages something. Oh God, we're back here already. Oh, I didn't think it was here. Let me see the item real quick. So if I go to buy uh, Tempe for Colleg, uh, maybe that's that's not what I want. I don't want to pursue. Okay. Yeah. Fine. Okay. So we're going to scrap the idea. Now, why is this happening? Why is this happening? Okay, guys, so about 25 minutes later with no progress, we're finally getting this episode started. So I gotta do some of the puzzles again, I guess, to get back through, but it shouldn't take too long. At least I hope so. So we're probably gonna do like a jump cut style thing until I can advance to where I got to last time. Aha, now the pyropes, there's two of them. If I heat them up, I think it says that when you see the orange flames, you don't move, so you crank it up. Let's see if this works. Ooh, different attack. Fair enough, fair enough, fair enough. Well, when we can, we'll give it a try. Yo, that blast radius. Are you kidding me? Want some more heat? You got it, okay? Heat this up again. You crank up the thermostat, it was so good. Ha, huh. so it's just this continual attack over and over again? Yo, how am I supposed to- 
This is ridiculous. How can I dodge this? Okay, I can spare them both. I got 90 gold from that. Okay, and so now I go back to the save point to get my health back. Goodness! Okay, guys, so now we're finally back at the point it was before. We took down the two dudes, and Alphys has... He timed this up there, I'm telling you, man. Oops, wait! How's the human doing? Oh, gosh. We're gonna be checking in with this dude, like, every two seconds again. It is gonna be this. Top 10 shows up where you forget to do your freaking job! All right, um... What's the next update, Alphys? No more? Okay. It's awfully dark again. Hold up a second. Wait, we're walking? Ring? Let me guess. Alphys has given us a ring, right? Okay, I'm back. A another dark room, huh? D -d Don't worry. My, my hacking skills have got things covered. Oh, gosh. The MTT news? Are you serious? Oh, yes. Good evening, beauties and gentle beauties. This is Mattaton reporting live from MTT News. An interesting situation has arisen in Eastern Hotland. Fortunately, our correspondent is out there reporting live. Brave correspondent, please find something newsworthy to report. Our ten wonderful viewers are waiting for you. Um, let's see. I've got this kind of interesting, right? Water that hasn't dissolved? Hold up a second. Scientists discover the overall health benefits of using computers. Just kidding, lol. Okay, well, thanks for that one. Let's talk about this. Oh my! It's a completely mon- Uh, what does it say? Nondescript glass of water. But anything can make a great story with enough spin. Report this one. Uh, I want to look some more. Hold up a second. Yo, what the freak is that? Basketball? Basketball's a blast, isn't it, darling? Too bad you can't play with these balls. They are MTT brand fashion basketballs. For wearing, not playing. You can't get rich and famous like Moy without beautifying a few orbs. Report this one. Let's look some more. Kind of curious. What else we got popping? There's a dog here. What is this? A force field or something? As per journalist standards, a death force field surrounds the area of intrigue. The dog. What a sensational opportunity for a story. I can see the headline now. A dog exists somewhere. Frankly, I'm blown away. Okay, let's look some more. <laughs> a present. Oh my, it's a present. And it's addressed to you, darling. Aren't you just bursting with excitement? Well, what could be inside? Well, no time like that present to find out. Funny, laugh guy, like laugh, now. Nah bro, I wanna look some more, hold up a second. What is this? Ooh la la, this video game you found is dynamite. Though I don't make an appearance in it until three fourths in, but I like that. Appearing from the heavens like mana, slaking the audience's hunger for gorgeous robots. Ooh, that's Metaton. Let's not report this, hold up, this way. The force field. Now there's probably gonna be one more item nearby, perhaps down here. The freak is that, that looks like a Metaton book. Oh no, that movie script, how'd that get there? It's a super juicy sneak preview of my latest guaranteed not to bomb film. Metaton the movie. Uh, what is that? 23? No, 28. Sorry, Matatan. I've heard that like the other films. It consists mostly of a single four-hour shot of rose petals showering on my reclining body. Ooh, but that's not confirmed. You wouldn't <coughs> spoil my movie for everyone with a promotional story, would you? Let's not report. I might report the dog. Who? That was close. You almost gave me a bunch of free advertisement. Yeah, you ain't getting that today. Yo, we're gonna report the dog. This is fascinating. Attention, viewers. Our correspondent has found a dog. Cute audience ours. That's right, folks. It's the feel-good story of the year. Look at his little ears, tiny paws, fluffy tail. Hold up. Wait a second. That's not a tail. That's a fuse. What the freak? That's right. That dog is a bomb. But don't panic. You haven't even seen the rest of the room yet. Freak. There was only one? Which was good? Oh my. It seems everything in this area is actually a bomb. That presence, a bomb. Oh, that basketball's a bomb. Aha. Uh -huh. Even my words are... Okay, well, this is getting very peculiar right now. Brave correspondent, if you don't defuse all of the bombs, this big bomb will blow you to smithereens in two minutes. That's it's five. Then you won't be reporting live any longer. How terrible, how disturbing. Our nine viewers are going to love watching this. Good luck, darling. Oh boy. Ring, ring. Yo, d -d -d don't worry. I installed a bomb diffusing program on your phone. Use the diffuse option when the bomb is in the diffuse zone. N -n now go get them. Wait, in the diffuse zone? Like, what, this? I don't really understand what I'm doing. Diffuse the dog. Aha. I don't want to fight, though, so maybe act. But there. Okay, diffuse bomb. Wait for it. Right there. Nope. Diffuse failed. Aim for diffuse zone. Okay, there. Okay, dog diffused. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go. What's the next thing? Great job. Keep heading around that room. Try to go for the one in the bottom left next. Bomb left. What, this thing? What the heck, dude? Uh, what? What the freak is going on? I just saw it. It's right there. Oh, man, this one's tough to get. I'm gonna have to wait this out. Okay, got it, got it, got it. All right, let's... No, I don't want to fight the bomb. Why am I fighting the bomb? Stop. Dude, this is terrible. Uh, let's act. We'll get ready to defuse right now. Okay, that's done. That's two out of six. And it's only taking us, like, two minutes to do that. Let's get the basketball next. It's coming right here. Okay, we've got to be quick. We've got to be quick. Okay, defuse this. There. What? What the freak? Really? There? Okay, that's the third one. <laughs> this is going to go terribly wrong. <laughs> Wait, we can go down here somewhere? Yo, what the freak, dude? So... 
Oh my god. Okay, move through there. All right, now we move through here. Let's defuse this one real quick. This is not going to work. This is really not going to work. Oh boy, okay. So now, okay, that's the fourth one. That timer though, dude, I'm just saying. So, yeah, we're definitely going to miss this one, guys. This is the fifth one. All right, let's uh, defuse this one. Okay, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Right there. I've got one left. What the freak is it? Maybe up here. Great job. There's only one left at the top right. Oh boy, let's go, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, right here. I gotta do this real quick, man. All right, defuse the bomb. No! Oh! <laughs> Just about got that. Well done, darling. You've deactivated all of the bombs. If you didn't deactivate them, the big bomb would have exploded in two minutes. Now, it won't explode in two minutes. Instead, it would explode in two, two seconds. Goodbye, darling. What the fr- What do I do? Um, hold up. I do nothing. Ah, it seems the bomb isn't going off. That's b because while you were monologuing, I, I, I fixed, um, I, I mean, I changed. Oh no, you deactivated the bomb with your hacking skills? Yeah, that's what I did. Curses, it seems I've been foiled again. Curse you, human. Curse you, Dr. Alphys, for helping so much. But I don't curse my eight wonderful viewers for tuning in. Dude, that number's dropping. Until next time, darling. But wow, but we, we really showed him, huh? I mean, kinda. Hey, I, I know I was kind of weird at first, but I really think I'm, I'm getting more, uh, more, more confident about guiding you. So don't worry about that big dumb robot. I I'll protect you from him. And, and if it really came down to it, you could just turn. Uh, never, never mind. He puts the phone down. Yo, blast me on out of here. Let's go. So this bomb right here, we can't even talk about it. We can't look at it. That's probably for the best. I shouldn't be messing with bombs and stuff like that. And we're just free to basically go on our way. Complete silence filling the lands, but this is progression. This is what was necessary. Yo, we're getting close to the machine. Can't observe it. I mean, we can, but we can't talk about how close we are to it. But we are definitely making grounds. The phone rings as well. Um, I notice you've been kind of quiet. Are you w worried about meeting Asgore? W well, don't worry, okay? The, the, the king is a really nice guy. I'm sure you can talk to him. And w with your human soul, you can pass through the barrier. So, so, so no worrying, okay? Just forget about it and smile. Hmm. Maybe, maybe, maybe. I guess we'll find out. Another elevator though taking us further up. Let's go in this thing. Please select a location. We can go left floor three. I think that's the only other location we can get to now. So we gotta go up. We gotta keep progressing through this place. All right, here we go. Yo, now things are starting to get a lot more high tech. Who the freak is that? And also, who the freak is that? Let's talk to him first. I, I, I ended up buying a donut. I, I, I didn't want to, but the girl, even though I told her no, she she kept staring at me in this creepy way and licking her lips. N now I'm out of cash. Welcome to our parlor, dearie. Interested in some spider pastries? All proceeds go to real spiders. I mean, check out the webs to make a purchase. Right here, so we can look at this one. Buy a spider- What the f- Yo, that's very dear. How about this one here? What the f- Spider bake sale. All proceeds go to real spiders. I mean, I bought some stuff in the starting zone, right? Check out the webs to make a purchase. I mean, I tried, but your boy's not rocking 10,000 G. Most people don't. Hold on, we got a call coming through. Hi, Alpha's here. Th this room is like the room we saw before. I can tell. There are two puzzles in the north and south. You'll have to solve them both to proceed. Also, I'd like to say, I don't really like giving away puzzle solutions, but if you need help, just call me, okay? Actually, wait, I have an idea. Let's be friends on Undernet. Then you can just ping me when you need help. W wait, we're already friends, aren't we? I, I signed you up, didn't I? You've been reading my posts the whole time. Well, I hope you agree with me about Mew Mew 2. Click. I I've never played that game, dude. Stop talking about it to me. So, puzzles in the north and south, huh? Maybe we should make our way to one of them? Well, obviously, what the heck? Okay, this is our way down south, just like so. Let's solve this one first. We've got a Take the elevator here. So with these ones, we don't move. I was not moving right there, dude. I think I wasn't moving at least. Okay, so don't move, don't move. Yo, you can't help it with these ones. It's always moving you, right? Oh boy, I'm gonna die also. This sucks. Hey, this um doesn't have anything to do with guiding you, but uh, would you want to watch a human TV show together sometime? It's called uh, Mew Mew Kitty Cutie. Sure or no? Uh, sure. Uh, really? It's so good. It's uh, my favorite show. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Slow down. Dude, if you guys can read this, translate this in the comments down below. Um, yeah, he's very passionate about this. We should watch it after you get through all this. Bye. Okay, so puzzle number one anyway. Ooh, it's more of this stuff. So shoot the opposing ship, you have just one shot. So we've got to try and confine these down here then. Well, that one like so. Then we put this one here. And then, ooh, how can we get that one across? Like that. There we go. Then we take the shot. So that's the first puzzle done. Thank you very much. Congratulations. All right, let's get back out of here then. Now, hold up. What the freak is this? Can I, I can't even talk to it. Hi. I want to, why do I want to talk to a cactus, by the way? My health is kind of concerning. I'm going to be real. 
Hmm, I really don't like my odds right now, guys. Unless there's maybe a save point somewhere nearby. At least I hope there's no more lasers, because this will be my end. Here we go. Let's go on over here. Let's see. No more lasers, fortunately, as well with this one. So, what's the catch with this one here? Shoot the opposing ship. You have just one shot once again. Okay, let's see then. How can we figure this one out? It's just trying to see the movements and where things can be placed. Let's see, we could put that there. That down, and that one across. Okay, so that gets rid of those ones. Now, what about if I did something like... Uh, wait, hold up. If I did this, and then move that across... Okay, that does nothing. That's great. Hmm, there's a certain way about this, right? That is that certain way. <laughs> <laughs> it's always when I least expect to figure out I end up doing it. So there we go. That's both of those solved. Now we can proceed across, correct? Up, yin and yang. My favorite magician moment? Right when everything looks baddest. He poses dramatically. Like when he's on a cooking show and the eggs don't turn out right. That's great. How about this dude here? My fave Mediton moment is when he beats up the heel-turning villains, even if it's during what's supposed to be a quiz show. Yo, he gets violent on the quiz show, and these people love that as entertainment. Okay, so we're probably going to get over to this side here. And there we go. It's like a fairly straight walkway. Now, please, no monsters spawn. Oh, boy. At least the door's open for us, right? A brand new zone. Please be a safe point. Hallelujah! The smell of cobwebs fills the air. You're filled with determination. The smell of cobwebs. Now, that's never something I've really pondered on. I've never picked up a cobweb and, you know, sniffed it. Also, I'm going into a mouse hole. Okay? I'm going into a spider hole, which looks like a mouse hole. <laughs> Did you hear what they just said? Was that me talking or- wait, what? Hold up, we're in a spider lane right here. They said a human wearing a striped shirt will come through. Oh boy. I heard that they hate spiders. Well, some do, but they may have heard wrong. I heard that they love to stomp on them. Some definitely do. Guys, if you're one of those people, I'm sorry, man, don't be like that. I heard that they like to tear their legs off. Again, if you're one of those people, skip you, man, no time for you at all. Spiders just need a place to go. They don't know what they're doing in this built-up world with human crap. I heard... Oh gosh, I'm stuck in the web. I'm tangled up. Oh, it's the girl who was on the spider sale. That they're awfully stingy with their money. Oh, you think your taste is too refined for our pastries, don't you, darling? Oh, I disagree. I think your taste is exactly what this next batch needs. Is she gonna- is she gonna eat us? Yes! Yo, Muffet traps you! Um, now, a lot of people said to hold on to the item, which I don't got in my inventory! Don't look so blue, my dearie. Oh, boy. Now, I don't really mind if we aren't able to get around this. Oh, boy. Now, what the freak? It's like musical notes. I think purple is a better look on you. <laughs> you know what? Hold up a second. We're going to restart when I've got, like, the uh, pastry thing that I had before, you know? Wait, there's, like, no item boxes nearby. What the freak? Why would they give you an item to use and there's, like, no way to get to it instantly? Unless maybe it's, like, an Easter egg thing? Okay, well, I'm going to do this and I'll see you guys soon, I guess. Wait, but what about if we go here afterwards, you know? She's not even here. It's a spider donut. It looks more rubbery than usual. Interesting. Maybe it's a fake one. What about this? It looks like some sort of powerful bracelet. Wait, it's just a croissant. It's kind of interesting how, though, if you backtrack just before that point, you can actually see that she's not even there. Wait, also, my dude is gone. You see that? That's really interesting. There's so many small observations that now you kind of notice. Also, wait, why am I here? Where am I? Hold up a second. And I want to structure looms. I think I'm right near the lab, if I remember correct. Let's just take a look. Might be. What the freak? Where am I? Hold up. It's glued to the table. I'm back at the cooking show part. What is going on? Can I steal anything in this gig? It's a microwave. It's great if you're a microwave fan. Uh, how about this? It's an oven. Looks pretty modern. All right, guys. I made it all the way back to Snowden just to try and find an item box. I know there was one right here, man. So use the box. Yes. Let me use that good stuff. So the spider donut. And I've got spider cider. No, I should probably take both of those. I wonder if that will actually help us with this next step, though. It would be interesting if it does. Now, at the inn, I think if it said you sleep here, you get more than max HP, so I may as well do that whilst I'm here too. ATG, that's like one battle, so here's your room key. Make sure to bundle up. Don't tell me what to do, all right? I'll do what I want. Why they sound like a butt trying to make as many possible different tones as possible? Wait, hold up. How long does this go on for, though? Because I don't really know what else to dance to. Hold up, they're stopping. We're done. Hiya, yeah. you look like you had a great sleep, which is incredible because we're only up there for about two minutes. Here's your money back. You can pay me if you're going to stay overnight. Yo, I got my money back too. Hold up a second. Did I get my health up for that? Let me check. So let's see stats. Yes, 30 HP. Let's go. All right, guys. So now I've got the stuff then. Muffet traps you. Um, let me see then. I've got the items. Let me see. What can I do? 
I could pay my money, so I could pay 10G. Why would I, why would I pay 10G? Uh, let me just try, I guess. You pay 10G, Muffet reduces her attack for this turn. That's interesting. Don't look so blue, my dearie. Ooh, so it's the same attacks again. Now, this must be her thing then. It turns us into like a purple heart, and we can bounce between these. I think purple is a better look on you. <laughs> okay, you're trapped in a strange purple web. Up next, uh, looks like spiders. <laughs> now, hold up a second, guys. How the freak do I use the items, okay? There's gotta be something I do here. Okay, so we're trapped in a web. Now, I'm gonna try the spider donut or spider sutter in a sec, but you struggle to escape from the web. Muffet covers her mouth and giggles at you. I just wanna see the attacks, you know? Why so pale? You should be proud. So, aha. That's kind of fun. I like this. Interesting. Up next, again, the spiders. Muffet does a synchronized dance with the other spiders. All right, now, I'm about to go ahead and consume one of those things. Uh, what the freak? Why, why can't I go over, like, the next page? I can. <laughs> I'm stupid. <laughs> spider donut? You ate the spider donut. Your HP was maxed out. Huh? Where did you get that? Did you steal it? Oh, my pet. It's, it's time to show them what we do with thieves. Wait. What the heck? Huh? A telegram from the spiders in the ruins? What? They're saying that they saw you and... You were really passionate about spiders? Oh my, th this has been a big misunderstanding. Well, I thought you were someone that hated spiders. The person who asked for that soul. They must have meant a different human in a striped shirt. Sorry for all the trouble. Uh -huh. I'll make it up to you. You can come back here anytime, and for no charge at all, I'll wrap you up and let you play with my pet again. Uh -huh. Just kidding. I'll spare you for now. Muffet is sparing you. Let's go, dude. I got no gold. Uh -huh. I'm, I'm gonna have to laugh like that, guys. Honestly, I'm gonna pass out if I do it any other way. That was fun. See you again, dearie. She's kind of cute. Why am I saying a spider that tried to kill me is kind of cute? Why am I- why do I like Muffet so much? She's a really, really sweet character, you know? Movie poster. It's a poster from Metaton's latest stage performance. A tragic tale of two star-crossed lovers kept apart by the tides of fate. Looks like it's almost time for the performance. Oh god. If I go to the next screen, I'm walking on stage right now, aren't I? Hold up, let's see. Interesting. Oh, that human. Hold up a second. He's willowing from above. He's watching us. Could it be? You've got to be kidding me, and dude, we're on stage. My one true love? Yo. <laughs> so what's the deal, huh? What is going on? It's so innocent. Oh, my love. I'm gonna sing it like this, guys. Please, run away. Monster King. Forbid your stay. <laughs> Humans must Keep it going, keep it going. Live far apart. Keeping the robot tones. Come on, guys, right now. Even if Go on, what's the what's the kicker with this one? It breaks my heart. Aw, Matt's turn. Come on right now. They'll put you I'm not moving, I know I've got control, guys. In the dungeon. How are you gonna rhyme dungeon though? It'll suck. And then you'll Die a lot. Nice. Dungeon and die a lot, I see that. Really sad. Matt's turn. You're gonna die. Come on, keep coming. Cry, cry, cry. So sad. It's happening. Why is he so- Is this a rap now? I'm, I'm so confused right now. So, how about it? So sad. So sad that you are going to the dungeon. Well, toodles. Yeah! I should have just left the screen, shouldn't I? Hold up, he's coming down with us. Oh no, whatever shall I do? My love has been cast away into the dungeon. A dungeon with a puzzle so dastardly, my paramour will surely perish. Oh God. Oh heavens have mercy, the horrible color tile maze. No, oh, each color tile has its own sadistic function. No man, come on. For example, a green tile sounds a noise and then you must fight a monster. Red tiles will actually wait a second. Didn't we see this puzzle about a hundred rooms ago? That's right, you remember all the rules, don't you? Great, then I won't have to waste your time repeating them. It doesn't matter. Oh, and you'd better hurry because if you don't get through in 30 seconds, a bomb's gonna go off, right? You'll be incinerated by these jets of fire. Ah, 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 ah. My poor love, I'm so filled with grief. I can't stop laughing. Good luck, darling. Oh my God, all my love has fallen down. I'm gonna sing the lyrics, guys. Now in tears, uh, we will all drown. Oh boy, okay, this way, this way. Uh, yo, these lyrics, make them a fool. <laughs> if only they, I gotta go this way. Still knew the rules. Oh boy, okay, that's a monster sound. Well, that was, yo, how the frick I get around here? What the heck is going on? Ah, uh, here, here, here. Okay, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Oh my goodness, I gotta get like... I didn't succeed. Ooh, I'm sorry, looks like you're out of time. 
I I'm, I'm, I'm cooked up, guys. Here come the flames, darling. They're getting close. Yeah, closing in. Getting closer. Oh my! Any minute now. Um. <clears throat> um. That was the robot cop, guys. The phone rings. Watch out! I'll save you. I'm hacking into the firewall right now. For real? Oh no! How could this happen? Born again by the brilliant Dr. Alphys! <laughs> Come on, Messerton. Give up already. You'll never be able to defeat us. Not as long as we work together. Your puzzle's over. Now go home and leave us alone. Puzzle? Over? Alphys, darling, what are you talking about? Did you forget what the green tiles do? They make a sound? Then you have to fight a monster. Well, darling, that monster is me! We're fighting Messerton. Metaton attacks! I did that in his voice as well. Alright, let's yell. You yell, nothing happened. This is it, darling. Say goodbye. Phone call him again. Is that your phone? You'd better answer it. Hey, this seems bad, but, but don't worry. That there's one last thing I installed on your phone. You see that yellow button? Go to this phone's act menu and press it. Okay, your phone act menu is glowing. Uh yellow, like this. You press the yellow button, the phone is impersonating Metaton's presence. Oh, that yellow glow! What the f dude, what is going on? What, what the heck is... Yo, my heart just went yellow. Now press Z! I don't want to hurt him though. Do I have to? Oh! Oh! You've defeated me! How can this be? You were stronger than I thought! Etc. Whatever! Okay. Well, look, 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 so you beat him! You did a really good job out there! All thanks to you. Let's say that one. What, what, oh, oh no, I mean, you were the one doing everything cool. I just wrote some silly programs for your phone. Now, hey, this might sound strange, but c can I tell you something? But before I met you, I, I didn't really, I, I didn't really like myself very much. But for a long time, I, I, I felt like a total screw up, like I couldn't do any anything with, without ending up letting everyone down. But, but guiding you has made me feel a, a lot better about myself. So thanks for letting me help you. Um. Anyway, we're almost to the core. It's just past MTT Resort. It's the same Mount Resort, I guess. Come on, let's finish this. Let's finish this indeed. Interesting how we're actually getting close to the core, though. Now I don't know if that means like close to the end of the game or something. I'm not really a hundred percent. Okay, this guy was selling ice cream, and these two dudes, how's the update, guys? How's it going? Oh, hey, we're, like, taking a rain check on that killing you thing. Like, don't tell and dine about this, okay? Sure thing. How about this one? He seems happy. Well, that's good. How about the ice cream dude? Hey, it's you again. Business is excellent here. These two fellas bought all my ice cream. I've actually sold out of everything. Sorry. Wait, I've still got something for you. A big smile. How about that? What a genuine dude. I appreciate that. No gold for it, though. Sorry. All right, what's this way on the screen, then? Level three. It's the fire dude again. How about this? Hey, hey, did you remember my name? Yes. What? what? You remember? How could I be so easily defeated? That's it. Uh, I always remember that you remembered. Okay. <laughs> Guys, we're out of here, man. Let's go up here a little bit more. What the freak is this? Uh, I can't read that, but Sans is here. Hold up a second. Hey, I heard you go into the core. How about grabbing some dinner with me first? Let's do it, man. Great. Thanks for treating me. Over here. I know a shortcut. Holy crap. Dude. Sans just wrote me into this mess really quick. Well, here we are. So, your journey's almost over, huh? You must really want to go home. Hey, I know the feeling, but oh. Though, maybe sometimes it's better that you take what's given to you. Down here, you've already got food, drinks, friends. It's what you have to do. Really worth it. He's thinking right now. Sans getting deep. No jo no fart joke? You want to do like a, the fart handshake thing? Ah, forget it. I'm rooting for you, kid. Oh my god, I'm having a heart to heart with sons. Hey, let me tell you a story. So, I'm a sentry in Snowden Forest, right? I sit out there and watch for humans. It's kind of boring. Fortunately, deep in the forest, there's this huge locked door, and it's perfect for practicing knock-knock jokes. So one day, I'm out knocking them out, like usual. I knock on the door and say, knock-knock, and suddenly from the other side, I hear a woman's voice. Who is there? So naturally, I respond, dishes. Dishes who? Dishes are very bad j uh. I bet when I hear a bad joke, guys, what can I say? Then she just pelts with laughter. Like, it's the best joke she's heard in a hundred years. So I keep them coming, and she keeps laughing. She's the best audience I've ever had. Then after a dozen of them, she knocks and says, Knock, knock! I see. Who's there? Old lady! Old lady who? Oh, I did not know you could yodel. Wow, needless to say, this one was extremely good. We kept telling each of her jokes for hours. Eventually, I had to leave. Papyrus gets kind of cranky without his bedtime story. But she told me to come by again, so I did. And then I did again and again. And it's a thing now, telling bad jokes through the door. It rules. Is that with Toriel? Maybe not. I'm not sure. One day, though, I noticed she wasn't laughing very much. I asked her what's up. Then she told me something strange. If a human ever comes through this door, could you please, please promise something? Watch over them and protect them, will you? 
Now, I hate making promises, and this woman, I don't even know her name, but someone who sincerely likes bad jokes has an integrity you can't say no to. All right, and he's watching over us in Santa's. Do you get what I'm saying? That promise I made to her, you know what would have happened if she hadn't said anything? Buddy. Ah, oh, Sans, you'd be dead where you stand. Dang, dude. He converted just because of what the woman said. Hey, line up, Bucko. I'm just joking with you. Besides, haven't I done a great job protecting you? I mean, look at yourself. You haven't died a single time. Hey, what's that look supposed to mean? Oh, am I wrong? I died a few times. I mean, yeah, we don't talk about the power. <laughs> Where's he going? Tending to the crops, huh? Well, that's all. Take care of yourself, kid, because someone really cares about you. That sounds like Toriel, I think, perhaps. It's very interesting. Can we maybe follow him? Maybe we could. It's a wall of fame full of quotes and photos from visiting celebrities. The food is to die for. Gorgeous, my style and fragrance. My face tastes beautiful. These are all Metaton. Oh, okay, so robotic voice inbound. What is this here? It's some kind of TV show featuring Metaton. Okay, what about this gingerbread man? Yo, I'm about to eat your foot. As I came in, I realized I forgot to make a reservation, but I didn't want to look like I messed up, so I kept walking in anyway. Now I'm just kind of consuming dew off this fist. Of this what? This fissus, did he say? Ficus. Originally, we dug mazes with puzzles in order to foil human attacks. But now, building and things and minding and confusing, it's some awful tradition. You can't go, uh, two feet without being up to your armpits and puzzles. Who is he dating, though? What is this guy right here? I work at the core. The inside is a maze made of swappable parts. That means we can shuffle the layout at will. Boy, was today a fun day. I sure love puzzles. By this guy here. I'm the result comedian. I'm very funny. People laugh at my jokes. Now, my son, he wants to be a comedian like his father. But his jokes aren't funny. He tells these awful puns. He's an embarrassment to our family. <laughs> That's not very funny. Since his mother passed on, he couldn't stand living at home anymore. So he ran away. I haven't seen him since. Uh, I'm a terrible father. <laughs> That's not funny. Yep, that's kind of reality that, right there, dude. Oh, these are the dudes that we fought before that would always tell the terrible puns and we'd laugh at them? Interesting. How about this? <laughs> yeah, so anyway, guys, we're leaving this place. No, Matt's turn right out there. Spewing! Everywhere. Welcome to the MTT Resort, Hotland's biggest apartment building turned hotel. Whether you're here for a night or still live here, MTT Resort prides itself in a great stay. Just passing through? Nice! Mount Resort prides itself in being passed through. Great. Let's save. The relaxing atmosphere of this hotel, it fills you with determination. So let's save our game with this one right there. Good stuff, thanks. Yo, all these monsters are very shapes. Yes, we know the elevator to the city is not working because of this incident. Rooms are running at a special rate. 200 year room. Nope. No, I'm good. Do let us know if you change your mind. Have a spectacular day. Or did he say a sparktacular day? How about these monsters? Yeah, I'm not going to be home tonight. Um, I, I think there's some cold pizza in my treasure hoard that you can hear. This elevator goes up to the capital, but it's not working. The hotel is doing its best to Accommodate everybody, stuck here. Yeah, so I can tell. As I slam, I'm outraged. That's literally all it says. Okay, so this is the shop. Welcome to the Mount Brandburger Emporium, home of the Glamburger. Sparkle up your day. Let's take a look at what he's selling. Starfate, Glamburger, Legendary Hero. Hold up a second. Uh, hero sandwich, attack up and battle. So we don't need that. And it heals 60 HP, don't ask please. Ooh, maybe that'll be worth doing down the line. For now, let's just keep exploring. Have a spectacular day! Yo, the music changed though. Hold up a second. I don't remember this before. Doors right here. Let's knock. Ooh, room service! You got my CT? Nope. And then, then? Okay. What about this one here? It's like from the inside. That's probably good. Knock on this one. Oh, room service! Cinnamon bun! Oh my gosh. If I didn't consume the cinnamon bun, I could have used it here. You guys told me to do it. I didn't know what else to do. Uh, let's check this way here. Okay. You hear shuffling. Seems like you could put something under the door. Put or no put. Uh... I'm gonna put something, uh, but you didn't have anything appealing. I gotta find something then. He seems busy. Now, the more I look at that, the more I see the uh, continual dilemma here. He's mopping up himself over and over again. Good luck with that slam, Janna. Now, there was a letter on the floor here. I missed it completely. Hey, go up the creepy alleyway on the right for some great deals. Uh, that seems a bit shady right now, but I'm gonna do it because I just saved. Let's go. Oh, boy. Do I want to do this? Hey, check it out. Yeah, check it out. Dude, these people are dope. Hold up a second. Junk food, empty gun. Uh, a mystery key, probably to someone's house. Ooh, what about if that mystery key is for the house back in Snowden? You know what I mean? Might be, I'm not sure. What else could that be for? Okay, we'll probably be back there in due time. Now, let me see what else this place has got to offer, because I've got to do something, right? If we actually go up here, the core. Wait, hold up. I thought it said that the elevator stuff wasn't working. Hold up. Let's see this. There's two people guarding it. Someone's calling. Huh? Who are they? N nobody else is supposed to be here. Oh, well, we can't worry about that now. He puts the phone down. 
Hmm. I at least want to check this out, guys. This is the core entrance, though. Very, very technological. Look at this, man. You got circuit boards running through the floor. Phone rings, though. Ready? This is it. Take the elevator up to the top of the core. He hangs up. Yo, I am ready yet. We've got different doors. I, I gotta check out at least one of these, though. All right, let's see this then. Hey, what? Are okay, I didn't hear what he said right there. The two dudes are. Watch out! Yo, who the freak are they? I gotta see who they are, man. Magic pops out of its hat. Axe. Magic. Uh, clear mind, or we can stare. Let's stare. Hold up. Where to stare? Chase it up or the corner up. Let's stare the chase one. The unrelenting chase up has weakened by your glare. Alakazam! Oh my. Woo! My goodness me. Look at this bull crap. Okay, keep dodging this. Oh, dude, that one hit. Okay, magic whispers arcane swear words. Bro, what's wrong with you? Why would you do that? Let's clear mine. You ignore magic and think of pollen and sunshine. Your defense increased by one. Oh, that's something. Tickle, tickle, hoy. Ooh, what the freak are these, man? Dodge them all. Woo! Whoa, these are a lot more busy. Magic flaunts its orbs in a menacing manner. All right, well, he can do that. Let's uh, talk to him, okay? Magic interrupts you by chattering to itself. It seems satisfied. Abracadabra. Again, dodge more of this. These attacks aren't so bad at all, to be honest. You don't really have to move that much. So, get through that. It does a mysterious jig. Okay. We can actually spare it right now. Let's spare it then. Uh, 60 gold for that one. Okay. Th that, that was close. Why are there so many monsters here? I mean, it, it's no problem, right? We've just got to keep heading forward. Sure thing. Alright, what is this one? Dude, look at this. We've got like force fields here, so I can't pass that though, right? It looks like you can't proceed until you hit the switch, but the lasers will activate when you do. Um, looks like they'll come in this order. Orange, orange, blue. Got it? Move until the third one. Okay. Okay, guys, you know what? I think I'm actually gonna leave this here because we're at the core by this point. There was some stuff as well back in the resort which I haven't taken care of, and I do want to actually focus on some stuff, like the mystery key. What is that for? It's clearly for something, and I do want to try and figure that one out. I feel like if we go through here, we're gonna get no chances of probably going back after this point, so we've gotta make sure we take all of the opportunities we can. So for this episode, guys, this is where I'm gonna leave it here, and I hope you did enjoy. If you did, why not drop me that like crane? And hey, if you're new around here, why not subscribe for more videos just like this one right here? So thank you so much for watching this video, guys. Of course, I hope you did enjoy, and I will, of course, see you on the next one.